Hey, you! What do you want here? I need some equipment for my ship. Oh, sorry, can't help you there. It's Captain Slane you need to be talking to. I don't suppose you know where Slane buried his treasure. Are you serious? Even if I did know, be more my life's worth to tell anyone. At least tell me if it's somewhere on Antigua. Here? <laughs> now that'd be a piss poor hiding place, wouldn't it? Point of hiding it is that you don't have to hang around keeping an eye on it, yeah? Now, rest you and your questions bugger off sharpish before the captain hears about it. You know where I could buy some supplies around here? New in port, are you? Sounds like it. Try the pub. They'll point you in the right direction. Or our Scarlet the Harlot, down at the pier. Always happy to help, she is. Nice ship you've got there. It gets the job done. Do you mind if I take a look around? Help yourself. Thanks. I will. You crew here? Certainly do. And glad of it. Ship's cook, me. Responsible for keeping them all well fed. Not that I ever get much thanks for it, of course. One more thing. Fire away, sport. How many barrels of fish do you need? A couple will do. I can get them from Eddie the Fisherman. Well, make sure you get the best stuff. I like a nice piece of mullet or snapper. Do you need any particular kind of cannon? Why? Have I got a choice? Wilson the Armor is a decent craftsman. I think I could get him to make something special. Anything that helps blow second arseholes into protectors will be good. Well, it's being delivered. Good work, sport. I'm impressed. The powder kegs are being delivered. I need three big ones at least. Yep, Rick's bringing them over. Excellent. Fresh water's on its way. Nice one, sport. That was my biggest worry. Get stuck at sea without water, you'll end up drinking your own piss. And that's just no fun at all. I have a helmsman for you. Really? Who? His name's Morgan. Any good, is he? No idea. Take a look at him. I will. Appreciate the tip, sport. He better not be mouthy, mind. Feel like talking? If you like. Pirate captain to pirate captain, you know what I mean? Got a taste for the buccaneering life, have you? I've had worse jobs. Yes? Like what? A few years back, I was with the Inquisition, under a foul-tempered goat fiddler named Mendoza. On Ferranga, we had to lock a titan back in its cage. You were a protector once. Yeah, but it feels like a lifetime ago. Times have changed, as you see. That's for sure, sport. My story's simpler. I was barely out of short trousers when Alvarez took me under his wing. A life on the ocean wave, free from women and home and duty. That's what I wanted. Better a short life at sea than a long one on land. Alvarez was your mentor, then? You might say that. He's not changed one bit. Still banging on about his precious creed. Still stuck in the past. How did you get your ship? I took her the way I'd take any woman. By force from some less lucky bastard. Nothing more to tell. Did you get on with Steelbeard? Ah, now there was a true pirate legend. I liked him. Learned a lot from him, too. Those are big boots you're walking in, sport. I know. What can you tell me about Garcia? A grasping, greedy snake of a man, but a fine captain. Always one step ahead of his opponents, Always finishes everything he starts. A dangerous man to cross. Where do you think he is? Garcia? No idea. Someone said he was seen on Caldera, but that's just hearsay. 
That's everything we need to put to sea. Then there's nothing to keep us here, sport. It'll be good to get out of this rat's nest. Just tell me when you're ready to go. We can now leave Antigua. Then get on that boat of yours. Tell your helmsman to put you ashore on the Isle of Thieves. Isle of Thieves? You'll see once you get there. All right, but you'd better not be far behind. Don't worry, sport. I'll be there. I'll see you on the Isle of Thieves. Both ships are fully stocked. Oh, you really are my hero. Slane says he wants to meet me on the Isle of Thieves. Hmm, I know where it is, but not much else about it. The name's not that encouraging. If you die, I guess we'll know it was a trap. It's time to set a new course. Aye, aye, Captain. Come with me. Great. Well, how does the pirate life suit you? All right for some, but it's not for me. Why not? The way I see it, pirates only live for three things. Grog, whores, and fighting. A man like me, you know, we need more than that. A purpose in life. You mean there's more to life than grog, whores, and fighting? Of course there is. There's honor, and doing what's right, and... Are you reading this from the Inquisition handbook? I know you aren't exactly the Inquisition's biggest fan. Oh, I believe in the things they're fighting for, just not the way they go about it. How did you end up becoming a protector? I used to be a farmhand, not a shit shoveler, a proper hard worker. One day the farmer sacked all his laborers and replaced us with slaves. Modernization, he called it. Exploitative goat fucker. There wasn't much else for me to do but join the Inquisition. Until today. How did you get to be a crack shot? No idea. Natural talent, I guess. They gave me a gun. I hit target after target right from the off. All right, let's carry on. Fine by me. A strange thing this life you've chosen for yourself? I'm my own master. That's how I like things now. No more being the Inquisition's errand boy. No more taking orders and dealing with their bureaucratic bullshit. I can certainly understand that part. But don't allow yourself to be too blinded by your newfound independence. Saving the world means saving all of it. Even the Inquisition and their ways. And not just the parts of it that suit you. I know. Then maybe there's hope for you yet.
Another pirate. I don't like seeing more than one in such a short time. Why? Who do you see? A man by the name of Garcia. Arrived in his ship a few days back. Said he had an important message for the High Council. Acted the nobleman. But I knew he was cutthroat scum. Where's he now? No idea. He sailed a few days ago. You could ask Carlos, I suppose. What was the message? Oh, he wouldn't tell me. Only the Council, he says. Said it was very important and from Mara herself. Go, please. Go on. Get out of it. Come on, let's both take it on. Rather you than me. I'm trying to teach these mummies boys some discipline. Isn't it obvious? I'll show them how to fight. Oh, so the hero of Faranga has his own methods, does he? Perhaps our hero would care to share some of his wisdom. You carry on. Stand to.
Shoulder arms. Commandant wants to talk to you. Well, did you find it? And more. I found the weapon, the one Steelbeard was after. Steelbeard's dead. But he told me this is one of four artifacts. Combined, they've got the power to kill Mara. Then you are in more danger than you know. Why? Because the High Council is about to sign a treaty with Mara. What kind of treaty? A peace treaty. And all magical artifacts we have must be handed over to her. She promises in return to let us leave in safety for Arborea. And the fools actually believe it. Sebastiano has been charged to take the artifact from you. He's already tried. I suspected as much when I saw which ship you sailed in on. Perhaps best you spare me the details of how you acquired it. I concern myself with the ends rather than the means. How could this happen? There's five on the Council, but only two who really make the decisions. Morigato of the Traders Guild and Commandant Corrientes of the Protectors. Corrientes is away, though, and Morigato is running the show at present. When Mara's emissary arrived, Morigato insisted on greeting him alone. What emissary? The pirate Captain Garcia. He and his men have allied themselves with Mara. Pirates sailing into harbor under flags of truce. I've seen it all now. Where's Corrientes? On an expedition to Arborea. He left not long after you did. What about this Morigato? What does he want? What does any rich and powerful man want? Even more of the same. He'll do whatever it takes to get what he wants for himself and his guild. I need to find Garcia. What for? He's got one of the four magical artifacts. After the negotiations, he visited Caldera before he sailed off again. Who knows where he might have gone. Maybe in Caldera you can find clues as to where he went. Caldera it is, then. You should start with Morigato. There's definitely a link between him and Garcia. The guard will open the gate. I'll see to it. Watch your back in there. What do we know about Mara? Mara is a titan lord with the power to command the oceans. But it looks as if that's not enough for her. It seems she wants to control everything. She's been setting her pack of monsters on us ever since we got here. Something tells me she doesn't want us settling in the new world. One good thing about it, though. With her attacking us, the water titans seem to have disappeared. But now... Now there is the Kraken. Is it one of the titans? Not as far as we know. It might be another kind of ancient being from the time of the Titan Lords. The thing's immune to cannon fire. I believe we may need a magical weapon to destroy it. And what about Ursigor? Ursigor. I wonder what would have happened if you hadn't freed him on Faranga. Maybe Ismail would have taken us all over by now. Maybe that is what destroyed the old Empire. Nothing to be done about it now. Though I've thought the same thing. Indeed. But for now, we need to turn our attention to Mara. What about Ismail? What do we know about him? Not much. Supposedly he and Ursigor laid waste to the old empire. It doesn't matter which Titan Lord wins. If they attack Caldera, that'll be the end of us. Even the magic crystals under the monastery won't help now.
Shoulder arms. Open the gate by order of Carlos. Very well. Typical. Get rid of one pirate and along comes another. How many of you? Hang about. Don't I know you? I don't know. Do you? Yes. I was your rum supplier. Don't you remember? Weren't you fired? Well... Those bastards. Well, if I can help, you say the word, mate. Do you know how I can get to the High Council? Just down there. But it won't help. There's no way they let you in. Let me worry about that. You know where Maragato's house is? Cross the bridge, first on the left. Can't miss it. It's the Mage's fault that things have gone this far. The Council was right to ban them from Caldera. Good riddance. But the Crystal Monastery won't protect us forever. They said we're sailing to Arborea soon. What's this? Has the Empire sent us another pathetic refugee? If you're after a job, I've got some crates that need hauling. I look like a refugee. Ah, sea rat, are you? You're not the first pirate to come here. There's other pirates? You heard of Captain Garcia? He was here. Then Morigato took him up to the High Council. And? And nothing. Politics, none of my concern. That's the High Council's job. My job is shifting crates. So what's in the crates? You pirates. Nothing worth stealing. Sugar, mostly. From Takarigua. It's keeping track of what comes in that's the real bugger. How can they send us the wrong number of crates? How hard can it be? If I ever find that fool on Takarigua, I'll shove his abacus up his ass. Shiny. Who's on the High Council these days? You really did just crawl out of the sea, didn't you? Five members, headed up by Scholar Custodio. There's Puko for the farmers, not the sharpest. Godin, a craftsman. Commandant Corrientes, of course. And Morigato, for us traders. He's the real power. So you better play nice, pirate. And the Council makes all the decisions? That's just the way it works, sea rat. Don't ask questions. They said we're sailing to Arborea soon. Oi! Where do you think you're going? My master Azoro doesn't want to be disturbed. They said we're sailing to Arborea soon. They'll keep their word. I know. Just be another war there. The hike? Got business here, have you? Is this Morigato's house? It might be, but you don't look like you've got an appointment. If your name's not in the book, you're not getting in. It's a surprise visit. The master doesn't like surprises. I'm here regarding an important matter that concerns Master Morigato. Mark my words, if he hears you try to keep me out, he won't be happy. Uh, yes sir. In you go. Yes? I want to see Morigato. Who shall I say is calling? No need. I'll find my own way. In that case, my master is upstairs. Rather, the chieftain Pagabudu was considered to be a cruel conqueror and displayed his enemy's heads at the ritual site of his village. His own skull is supposed to possess great magical powers. The Marakai have preserved it for several generations now. Lovely. You 
should know better. Good day. Something smells good. Thank you. I hope it improves my husband's mood. You looking for something in here? You'd better not touch anything. Yes? What do you want? I'm here about Garcia. And? Where? I don't believe that's any of your business, boy. He was here on important state business. That's all I'm prepared to say. You're lucky to get even that much, so be off with you. Don't disturb me again. I don't have time for riffraff like you. Your meeting went well, I trust. Nice. Is there anything that I can do? No, I haven't got time right now. The Inquisition's recruiting. They say they want brave men. That rules you out. You saying I'm not up to it? You get seasick, and you can't even fire a musket straight. How about I use you for target practice? Come on. I think you should stick to being a field hand. We'll just see about that. Wait a minute. I know you. You're the one who got himself expelled. I see word gets around. What was it again? Conduct unbecoming an officer. I got into too many fights with idiots. Well, no one's gonna give you any trouble here. And what are you supposed to be doing? Enlisting new recruits. If you're still on our side, you can give me a hand. Y you really think I'm the right man for that job? Once Inquisition, always Inquisition. After what they did to me? Well, if you won't do it out of loyalty, then maybe you'll do it for gold. Hmm? The Commandant pays a reward for every new recruit. I'll give you a cut of it. What do I need to do? Well, press ganging's been banned, unfortunately, so we have to be more subtle now. You see a likely recruit, you go up to them and start talking. Convince three men to join up, then we're in business. What about women? 
<laughs> In the Inquisition? Have you been drinking? It's just an idea. <laughs> just make sure you don't let the Commandant hear that. He's very traditional-minded, our Commandant. What sort of recruits are you looking for? No riffraff and no servants and the like. Try normal citizens and workers. Got it. I'll help you. Excellent. Sign up three recruits and you'll get a reward. Enjoy interrupting a busy man, do you? You the man with the guns? <laughs> Good eyes of you, then. Although Master Godin is the gun expert, really. Me? I just turn his ideas into reality. Who's he? Who's he? Only a genius when it comes to improving any kind of firearm. You know, double wheel locks. That was his idea. No wonder they gave him a place on the High Council. Men and their toys. They'll be comparing muzzle sizes soon. I have to get into the High Council. The only time I've been there is when Master Godin has had a task for me. If you're not a member, you'll need a sealed letter. Try talking to Morigato. Maybe you can enter his service. Do you sell weapons as well? To you? Hmm. Well, you're not officially one of us, are you? You'd have to bring me a written application, signed and sealed. Or I could just pay now, in gold. Yeah, that works too. Is there anything you can teach me? Master Godin's a far better teacher than me. But if you're looking for faster reloading times, or you want resistant tension springs installed, then I'm your man. Do you want to trade? Nothing here for me. You'd be a perfect recruit for the Inquisition. You think so? I had thought about joining. Then why don't you? Well, does it make you popular with the, um, ladies? I can see you have noble intentions. Everyone in the city relies on the Inquisition to stay safe. And trust me on this, the women just love the uniform. So... Right. Where do I sign up? Sign up for the Inquisition. You're a member of the Inquisition? Really? Well, I used to be. That good, is it? You need to work on your sales pitch, mate. Hey, don't go! I 
I'm actually working undercover. Really? They actually do that stuff? And I thought you were so dull. Do you, um, think I could do that? You have to work hard, but yes. I can do that. Make me a spy. Keep it down. Go find Lopez. I am reporting for duty. Lovely. Name? El Fidelo. Can you hold a musket, El Fidelo? Well, er, uh, I... Not to worry. You'll manage. Sign here. All right, I'll come and get you when we're ready. Name? Marco Antonio Pavaretti de Venga. Right. Marco it is, then. No, no, my name is Marco. Moving on now. Got any special skills, recruit Marco? Well, I received instruction from a private tutor. My parents wanted me educated as a... Uh... I'll just put down standard, shall I? Off you go. We'll let you know when we're ready to go. The High Council will choose peace, then all Not this now. trouble will finally be over. Peace? Haven't you seen what's happening in the North? Peace? Peace is our only hope. Not now, later. You should be helping the Inquisition. Look, friend, I just got used to not almost being dead. No chance I'll be putting my life on the line again. Why don't you let me help you? Why don't you piss off? Isn't there something you should be getting on with? The Inquisition needs you. You must be off your chump. Didn't you see the size of those monsters? I ain't fighting them. Not to worry, you'll be properly trained. <laughs> All the training in the world wouldn't stop one of those bastards. This will all end badly. My husband thinks the same. I... Can I get you something? This will all end badly. My... Oi! You! See what I've got here? Pirate sabers, fruit from Arborea, parrots from Takarigua. See anything you like? How's business? So-so. Takarigua's sugar is where the money is right now. Only that damn Morigato's got a monopoly on it. How do you manage that? How do you think? Because he's on the High Council. Ah, uh, I see. And now he's letting pirates into the city. Pirates? Whatever next? Tell me about it, miss. Corrupt. That's what I call it. I bet one of them was Garcia. I don't know. But he was here long enough to need to stay in the hotel. And he was in the High Council building. Can you believe it? This will all end badly. My husband. I don't want anything to do with this. That's what my husband says. It's not good. Not good. Join the Inquisition. Be the best. Lopez has found himself another mug, has he? Save your breath, new boy. I've heard all that be the best bullshit before. Maybe, but do you know what else is in it for you? Go on then. Impress me. There's regular money. Regular money sod all used to me when I get sent out into the jungle, where there aren't any taverns. You get a musket, for starters. No, you don't. Only protectors get muskets. New recruits get sabers, that's all. That's not true. Each new recruit is trained to shoot a musket, his own. You sure about that? Ask Lopez if you don't believe me. Maybe I will. This will all end badly. My husband thinks the same. I don't want anything to do with this. 